These are our top stories today. There is no need for Tengku Razali Hamza to revive the old Amno, as the Malay party remains intact, said Padang Rengas lawmaker Nazri Aziz. He added that Kuli wants to revive old Amno because he regrets being indirectly involved in banning Amno three decades ago. Nazri also claimed Kuli took such a stance because he was disappointed that Amno did not nominate him as the prime ministerial candidate. The current infighting between Amno in Melaka will benefit Pakatan Harapan, which could emerge as the winner in the imminent state polls. Analysts said. They said that the conflict between its two former chief ministers, Sulaiman Muhammad Ali and Idris Harun, will register at the ballot box among voters who may just swing to PH. After its rollout earlier this year, few seem to be using the government's COVID-19 vaccine certificate verifier application even as more sectors reopen with shopping malls preferring to stick to the MySajatra app. The digital certificate verifier was launched in May and upgraded in August to accommodate new digital features of the COVID-19 vaccine certificate in MySajatra. To read more, click on the link below or head to themalaysianinsight.com. <laughs>